YouTube, how's it going? It's me, the Kaluser, and this video is going to be on the Azul Quantum XS, which is a fanless Windows 10 mini PC stick, full Windows 10 operating system, Intel Bay Trail T Quad Core, 1.8 gigahertz. The RAM is 2 gigabytes of DDR3, 32 gig of memory, and let's unbox this, get all the paperwork. So we got a warning saying, caution hot, do not touch. Here's the guide of how to plug it in, how to work it. I'm really excited about this product here because it's an actual computer, Windows 10 PC on a little stick. All right, so we have its own wall charger and micro USB, so we don't really necessarily have to use this. You can use your own cables for it. Let's get a closer look at this. Look at that design. It feels good to touch, too. It doesn't feel cheap either, like I'm telling you, like it's, it's plastic, but it's like thick, heavy plastic, so that's a good feel to it. Micro USB port, USB plug-in. There's a lock in there, and it's gonna be the power. Nothing on the bottom, and then it has a micro SD card slot, so you'll be able to stick in one of these cards for extra memory, because it's only 32 gigs. And on the back, we have the Ethernet plug-in. Instead of using the Wi-Fi, depends what you wanna do, you can plug it directly, just a regular HDMI plug-in. So, we're gonna do its first plug-in and process to figure this out. Okay, so I'm gonna plug this in the back of my monitor. It could be a TV or a monitor. You can see I'm gonna give it the power source here. And for my keyboard, mouse, obviously your new computer needs to have that, so that's sold separately. I'm gonna plug in this little USB dongle, and now I'm pretty much set up to have a computer working. I'm gonna plug it right in the back. Okay, I'm gonna hit the power right now. A little click just popped. Azul technology inspired by real people. Lots of great features to get excited about. Okay, we are finally in the boot screen once you go through the whole process and loading. Now just in case you're wondering why is there black spots here, this is an ultra wide. That's why the black bars are there. You're not gonna see that on a regular monitor. So we have a fully functional working PC. Let's go to YouTube. Type in cool loser tech. There I is. The whole room is quiet. It's like a whole entire PC on a little dongle. Look at that, it's already detecting all my stuff as Windows 10 should. Let's look at what's coming up. That's actually all my information in my mail. Verify your identity. Everything's popping up really fast. Let's go to the store. You'll be able to download some games here, more Forza Motorsports. Okay, so I'm gonna click on Candy Crush here. Everything looks smooth. Reach the chest and go. For the record, this isn't gonna be a gaming machine, obviously. It's gonna be for the light type of use where you wanna play some games, do homework. I'm gonna press the Windows key, pops up, FN, Windows key. Look at that. So far, everything that I'm doing seems to be working just fine. Let's go into the system, storage. There's 28 gigabytes of storage and there's 10 gigabytes used. Let's check out the RAM. Control Alt Delete, Task Manager. See what's running. The CPU has 4% of stuff running on it, so it's doing great on that. Let's go into the performance, see CPU stats. Two gigabytes, only 1.3 is being used right now with everything that's open. We have one, two, three, four, and five windows open, as you can see, so it's only 1.5 out of two gigs. So you're not gonna be able to do too much of multitasking, but so far everything has been working just fine. Completely quiet, no sound from it. You just carry it in your pocket, plug it into your TV in a hotel or whatever, go to your friend's house, and you'll be able to have your whole PC carried with you. Especially if you log into your Microsoft account, even your PC at home will be able to sync with this device so everything will be cross synced. And that's awesome. Unplug it right here to show you. I'm just gonna literally just unplug it. It's not probably a good idea. But just to show you that it was plugged in and it does have a little bit of heat to it. Not like hot where I wanna be burnt, but um, it's still powered, it's just disconnected. Okay, so here I'm gonna be turning my TV, look at that, into a PC. Press enter, there's the cursor. We're gonna click on Chrome download. I'm gonna exit out of this edge. I don't like using that. And while that's downloading, I'm actually connected 
with this dongle inside my Xbox, you can see I want to go home, and it goes home, so I'm using my Xbox, and so what I did is put it in the back, because the Xbox has an HDMI in, so I can use my Xbox when I turn it on, this will be turned on, and my computer is right here in this window. I'm not saying you have to plug it in to make it work this way, I just wanted to try it, and it worked. And as you would with a normal PC, you know you can just click into your apps. Maybe you don't have Android TV or an Xbox or a PS4 and you want to get this as a, you know, your first PC to make anything a computer. You can do Netflix, we click on Netflix. You can do Hulu, you can do all your documents, your spreadsheets, you can do PowerPoints. I hope by now you understand what I'm saying that's easily going to be able to handle all this on top of stuff that I don't really do like Microsoft Excel, Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Skyping, all that stuff that you can do on a regular PC, you can do on this mini PC which is portable and converting any TV into a PC. I hope you understand what I'm saying. Basically everything I'm throwing at it, it's doing it. It's not the fastest, but it's doing well. I'm surprised of how much you're paying for this and how much it will do. This isn't for everybody as it's just an entry Windows 10. This did perform better than some tablets that I used with Windows 10 that were under $100. This is just the same kind of concept, except it's in a little thing that you can make any display TV monitor as far as you, I'm trying to say into a computer monitor all right so there you have it this is the Azuli Azul Windows 10 dongle that you can carry anywhere whenever you want so that's it for me thank you for watching and as always I will see you guys next time later